right, welcome back to the morning show on ETV on this Feel Good Friday. Thank you so much for choosing to uh, stay with us. Now we're joined by a very remarkable young woman. She is no stranger to your TV screens, definitely no stranger to us here on the morning show. You know her as Mampo on House of Zwede. We're so glad to have her back here in studio. Her name is Khaisang Noche. Khaisang, welcome back to the morning show. Thank you. You look absolutely beautiful. You, you look stunning. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. First of all, um, this year marks exactly a year, right? Mm -hmm. Since you joined House of Zwede. Yeah. You started shooting in May of 2021. How has this journey been? Unbelievable. It's been magical, it's been fun. Uh, I learn a lot every day, I'm still learning. Yeah. So it's almost surreal, it's like pinch me. Please. Right. Yeah. What have been some of your, your favorite things about the show? You know, those, those defining moments for you in, in, in the past year or so? Mm. Being able to tap into a character like Mampo. Yeah. So, Effortlessly, how it, it seems as if she comes so naturally to me, which is sometimes scary, but also it's like it feels like wow, okay, I'm I'm doing this. So, um, so how do you do that? How 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 do you do that? What is the technique? Is there a technique that you use for you to be able to get into a character like Ya Ya Mampo? You know, someone who's very resilient, someone who looks like they will go <laughs> to all sorts of lengths to make sure that they get whatever it is that they want. Yes, yes, and yes. And I mean, I'm sitting with you here and I'm seeing someone who's very sweet, who's just like, yeah, it's been wonderful, it's magical. <laughs> and I'm like, yo, oh, hey, this is not the Mampo that I see on no, House of Sweet Day. No, no, hmm? no, no, no. Mump, uh, preparing for a character like Mampo, there are ways, there are techniques, you know. Um, the opposite of what I would do, not even the opposite, the outside of what I would do oh. is what Mampo would do. Um, she's not ashamed, she, and she will do it with her head, head up high. That's yeah. what I love about her, you know. Ah. Um, whether you like it or not. And then what happens, you know, when they say cut and they call it, it's a rap and you have been immersed in this character, Yaha Mampo, who is looking at Shoki like Kito Khama. Like what, what, what then happens after that? How do you get out of that back into Khaisang and then you're able to continue with the rest of your day and interact with people also acting Libona? You know what, days are not the same. So the days where ah, it's easy to rap, ah, okay, listen to music, you're fine. And then there are days where you're just drained. Sometimes I cry. I have to cry it out, you know. Um, sometimes I just need to sleep. Yeah. You know, it, yeah. It, it, it depends on the intensity of what we were shooting on the mm. day. If it's like the really hectic stuff, I'll probably cry, talk to someone, sure. laugh, and then, yeah. It's a switch. It's hard, but it can be done. And we get better as we go, yeah. Mm. yeah. Tell me then about the, the, you know, the work that you constantly then need to do as your character evolves, as your character grows, I'm sure it's it's no longer the same, you know, mm. for, for when you started and where you, you are now. Yeah. What are those lessons and, and the work that has gone into this? Sure. Um, the lesson is separating self from character at all times. That's okay. the most important one. Because mm. sometimes I, I want to be like, no, but why would she do this? Why? Eh, eh. But then I have to remind myself that, girl, it's not you. So you, yeah, you be correct. And like I said, days are not the same. Yeah. So s s the lesson has been letting the character be, you know, um, it's okay to ask for help. That's beautiful. You That's know? beautiful. And, and, and speaking of, of, of it being okay to ask for help, you work with some Amazing remarkable people, people. Yes. iconic people that we grew up watching you. on our screens and now we're seeing you Luena as young exactly. as you are you know um, acting with those th those people yes how's that like and, and, and what are those lessons that, that you were able to like suck out of each person that you that you are interacting with it's it's crazy because it's like <laughs> we've been watching these people all our lives yeah. and then they're here and they want to help us and they're here for us you know mm. um, the people we work with, you know, um, Bo Mama Wini, Bo Louise, Bo yes. Babusi, yes. Bo Matepo, they very, they care about us first as people. Like that. And they care about how we are and how we should handle ourselves, especially in our industry. Yeah. They care about 
a mental health. They care about emotional health first. So being around those type of people is very nice. And like I say, they help us. So sometimes the character's going through something that I've never really been through and I don't know. And then you get them be like, okay, so when I went through this and then they talk you through it. Beautiful. You know, so Beautiful. it's such a pleasure to be around people like that. It's such an honor. It's just like... What a safe space. I like that. I Our like cast that. is the safest space ever. Like, we have so much fun together. We love each other. We're protective over each other. It's And of all the people that you've worked with, uh, Haisan, do you ever sit and think, I still want to work with so-and-so? You know, especially now that you're speaking of House of Zui Day and, and, and how much of, of a quality cast you are actually mm. working with. And I'm sure the crew would be the same. Who are those people that you look at in the industry and you're thinking, I'll definitely love an opportunity to still work with this person? Ha 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 ha. I would still love to work with um, Mama Tsulufelo. Oh. Ne? Wow. She, she plays Rakhari on the river. For the river. Her. Yes. Um, I mean, I'm open. I'm open. I'd love to one day work with Namdamo too, so, you know. Um, there's so many and of they, them. Um, I mean, flying the South African exactly. flag. Exactly. There's so many. Like this, God is the limit to oh. whoever I can experience. Beautiful. That's what I always say. So, right, I have to let you go. I wish I didn't yes. have to. <laughs> Lots is happening tonight. Uh, what, what, what can you tell us? What should we expect tonight? Because Reboni Mutu, Amy God is steps in. Some oh. people are saying this one is going to blame Shoki Are Umpushite. Drama, 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 drama. Why should we watch tonight? Because it's drama, because drama, it's drama, 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 drama. Listen, that was uh, Chai Noche joining us here on The Morning Show. You know her as Mampo on House of Zwite. And she says you definitely want mm. to watch tonight mm -hmm. because there is going to be drama, 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 drama. drama, drama. Let's drama. take a break. <laughs>